thrifted Christmas number two. Um, so uh, I went to this one uh, antique mall and there were two things that I bought at the antique mall. I bought this celluloid Santa and I paid up for him. I, I don't, you know, I like to find these things in grab bags and stuff like that, but he was standing and he was just really, really different. And um, I had just bought some Cupid dolls. Um, oh, oh, I don't want to drop him. Um, and uh, I just thought he was adorable. So I think I'll dress up my Cupid dolls for Christmas and they'll stand next to him. And then at the antique mall, I bought this box of goodies. And it said, uh, the tag said, vintage ornaments and i've never seen anything like this so maybe they're homemade maybe they're not but they look old the wires are all rusty and they they just look really old some of the papers peeling so it's not regular foil it's foiled you know foiled brown paper and then there were these there were two of these so I bought that box. I just thought they were really different and they will add to my vintage tree. Uh, I got, hold on. I got um, some old stockings. Got this one here. I got, this one's not that old, but it's very pretty and it has that old vibe to it. And the felt is the old felt. It's not the cheap new one. And then, hold on, these guys aren't old, but I did pick them up anyway. Um, this is another one. I don't know how old this is. I don't think it's very old, but I like it because it's old inspired and it was only a dollar, so couldn't pass that up. Um, okay, this little, this little thing here I got, I think it was, I don't know, 10 cents. Then there was a little Ziploc bag with some chotch in it. And I think it was like 50 cents or something. So I picked it up and I picked it up because I saw this in it and it's crunched. It's seen better days. I'm going to try to work on it and fix it, but it looks old. Looks like maybe somebody handmade it. I'm not sure, but I'm going to try to work on it and fix it. I like it. There were these little wooden guys, the Santa, Mrs. Claus. Hold on. Mrs. Claus and I'll oh, put her in there and there's Mr. Claus with a tree and these come in great for my assemblages and there was this and there was this guy and this little angel and this one that one which looks like to me like an Eskimo but we'll see so that, and then oh, I want to go along quickly. Um, I got these mugs. They were 10 cents a piece and they are, um, this was like at a warehouse kind of a thrift store. They're um, Wechterbach, Germany. So um, I found these, this set of four and they're all different and they're beautiful i don't know i'm gonna use them to decorate this christmas and then maybe maybe i'll sell them i don't know because i have so many mugs all right so then i found this and this was a dollar 95 this was at that little favorite place in south carolina look at that i want to find a globe to put Santa, this santa on flying around the world so I have to, I'm in search of a globe. In fact, I'm gonna look for it today with my girlfriend, Lana. This little Santa was in a bucket. His boots and feet are missing, or maybe that, I don't know. His boots and feet are missing and his hat was off. So I had to take him home. I'm gonna set him in something where you're not gonna notice his, um, his feet. And then a while back I had gotten three or four of these mugs with elves on them. And this is the first Santa one I found. So I got him, oh so sweet. I got this to, um, to display um, an ornament on. 
It was only 39 cents. It's dirty, I gotta wash it. Um, this little girl is holding a present. I don't know if I'm gonna save this. I know she's missing her boy, but I, maybe I'll put her next to Santa kissing Santa. <gasps> Wouldn't that be nice? I might do that. Okay, these little soldiers I paid up for, but they're Russian. There, there's a set of five. This is not the original box, but um, they were $10. But it was for a good cause. Uh, the, I believe the store that I got these in uh, helps veterans. So I got these. I thought they were oh so interesting. Okay, so <clears throat> I got this little German uh, music box and you, you know, I'm not gonna wind it. The only thing wrong with this is that it's missing its cross and I will fix that. I got some vintage ribbon, satin actually, very pretty satin ribbon. Um, Let's see what else, let me go over here. Okay, so this puppy was sitting in that warehouse place on top of a clothing rack and uh, he's got a beard and he's brand new. He's got the tags, he's brand new. I don't think he's, he, cause he wasn't in the store the first day that I went there. So he must've just come in there and he was only a dollar. And he's not, you know, he's not, vintage but oh my gosh i have a thing for stuffies so i got him all right so let's see how long is this video this video is taking too long um i got this set of lights and they work and i don't know anything about them but they're lanterns and they work and the plug is you know kind of old school so i love them they look so pretty um Put him here. I got, I picked this up to do an assemblage or to display some things and it was only 95 cents. So, uh, I got this manger scene. It's lighted, it has a light and it's old and it's made in Japan underneath it says. And it's, I love it because I saw the horse first. And I love it because it's Jesus's birth, but also because of the horse. Nobody, you know, thinks about the horse. So that's that for now. Part three will be in a little while.